point. So we have got 45% of the female population in the United States of America who have chronic inflammation going on in their body, stimulating cytokines, which stimulates the domino effect of all of the inflammatory cascade, which in, on top of creating localized symptoms, can create future problems of uh, the brain, the heart, the liver, the kidneys, um, and the pancreas, and others. Autoimmune disease. I mean, th there is so much that is unknown about inflammation. I don't. I, I want you to understand that we could study it forever. What we know is what we know is what we know, and the more that. Uh, the research community studies inflammation, the more they find out they don't know. But we know autoimmune disease, autoimmune disease is inflammation that is stimulated, autoimmune, the immune system is associated with inflammation. And autoimmune disease is, is the immune system, the inflammatory response cascade is stimulated against its own tissue. And autoimmune disease is diseases, there's multiple um, diseases of that type are poorly understood scientifically. Fibromyalgia is another example of an autoimmune disease that is poorly understood, but limited to females primarily. You almost never see a male with my fibromyalgia. It's almost exclusively females. Why? Because inflammation, because estrogen exacerbates inflammation. When you know these simple facts and connect the dots, it all becomes very obvious. It really does. 